Chatoyancy, or cat's eye, is another very unique property of certain minerals. It's often identified in minerals with a silky or satin-like luster. Here we can see, such as this satin spar, has a unique reflectivity as it's held and the light reflects at different angles. One of the more common minerals that is known to be chatoyant is this variety of quartz known as tiger's eye. Here we can see when it's viewed at one angle, the center stripe is dark brown, but when turned it becomes yellow, turned back brown to yellow. When viewed at different angles, the bands of color seem to change. This is occasionally polished and used in jewelry, such as this pendant. Again, notice how the color bands change when viewed from different angles. Sometimes this property is more subtle than others, such as this sample. Here again, we can see bands of color that change and that has a bit of the satin-like luster, but it's not as distinct as some of these other samples and certainly not as distinct as the cat's eye effect visible in these polished spheres. Similar to the property of chatoyancy is the property of asterism, such as we see here in these examples of this mineral sapphire. Asterism comes from the same root as the word astronomy or asterisk. It has to do with the stars. Here we can see a star reflected within the mineral crystal. This is typically when gems are cut with the cabochon or rounded surface. In this case, small needle-like rutile crystals are occurring within the sapphire, and those cause the light to be reflected in this unique six-pointed star or asterisk. Another mineral, such as this diopsid, we can see a simple X, or a four-point asterism. Many of you know that as an artist, I grow mineral crystals within the glaze of certain pottery. Here's a sample of one of the vases where I grew the mineral willemite, and you can see the mineral crystals radiating out from these central points. These minerals have a tiger's eye effect where they are chatoyant as they reflect light in the unique pattern off of the mineral fibers. This vase is particularly spectacular with the unique way that the light is reflected off the mineral fibers within the crystal. Again, this is the mineral willemite that is grown within the glaze. Thanks for watching, and I hope you join me again on another geology or earth science video.